every planet has a signification today we are going to discuss about what are the significations of the planet sun and what secret message he has to give us let's begin Namaste and welcome to Pramanic Astrology channel. I'm your host Prasad Mahajani, help you go further faster into Vedic astrological studies. The Sanskrit name for sun is Surya or Ravi. Sun basically signifies house number one, that is yourself, soul, health. House number nine, which is father. And house number 10, which is authority, power, career, standing out in your life. That's what it does. So sun signifies three houses, one, nine, 10. Let's see what are the best sign placements for sun. Sun gets exalted in Aries at 10 degrees. From 0 to 20 degrees Leo, it's in its Mool Trikon Rashi. And from 20 to 30 degrees Leo, it's in its own house, you can say. It's not neither exalted nor Mool Trikon. It's just in Leo, own house. What are the house placements which are more suitable for sun? The sun is comfortable in house 10, in house 1. House placement, the best house placement for any planet would be 11th house. And for sun, it is 10th house. Why? Because it is male. Sun signifies authority, government, power, leadership, career. It's all about 10th right? house. And if you have sun in the 10th house, all these things will get a boost. But this is just a part very small part of this you have to see the trimshamsha for the health then the d10 for the career and all these things but these are the primary observations you can have of your horoscope or for any any horoscope sun rules sunday what is the first thing that comes to your mind when you think of sun first thing which comes to my mind is light sun gives us light light can be consciousness or just pure light sunlight which we get every single day so the first signification for sun is light these are the key these are the key words or key significations associated with the planet sun the first thing is light the second one is consciousness what happens when you throw light on something on a darker object you can see the things when you see the, those things you have the clarity so the first signification is light it throws light into the world the light which we got also the consciousness it helps us understand who we are so light gives us clarity clarity gives us what exactly we need in our life what we want what we don't want as we can see it clearly once we what is what is once we have that clarity we can have a broader vision so sun is also associated with our vision this point comes uh, this point becomes important because sun is also related with the government so government has a vision authoritative figure has a vision sun gives vision Sun, sun is sun is always about day. Wherever there is a sunrise, there is a day. There is because it throws its light onto that part of the world. So it's always day when you see sun. Sun is the jiva, the soul, the seed of our consciousness is sun the soul constitutes our consciousness and soul help us understand who we are who we think we are i'm a president i'm a mayor i'm ceo i'm a minister i'm nobody this consciousness about yourself is given by the sun so the self-esteem as well as the ego comes under sun sun is the creator sun 
creates life on earth so creativity also comes under the significance of sun so in natural zodiac sun rules the fifth house so all the fifth house implications indications comes under the signification of sun naturally so he is a creator of life he gives he gives lives he gives life he is the primary life force behind the human beings so in many cultures sun is considered as god almost every ancient culture sun is considered as god what is the next keyword associated with the sun that is vitality vitality is primarily concerned with your wellness and your health sun represents your health sun is the signification for the center of the self sun is the center of our solar system sun is also our self so sun is the center of the solar system so it is the center of everything so that's what we think right we think of world in context of ourself keeping ourself as the center point that's what sun is all about that's what your ego is all about that's on the earth we don't really see the pure form of soul we see it in the form of our ego as in what we think we are and our intellect that's what these are the two things which we relate ourselves to and that's what we think we are the pure soul we don't really see in our human experience easily the sun is about the center what is the center government authorities are at the center all the government be it local global or sun as a center of the solar system so the government authority power all these are the signification which comes under the sun there is one more powerful signification by the sun is the stability sun is stable and reliable in our experience whenever we get up in the morning he is already there started working he is not lazy that really humbles me and inspires me to do what i am doing every single day that really makes me feel very small his stability and reliability is really what inspires me so that is the another signification that is reliability and stability there is also one signification of the sun which is father what is father father is the head of the family who is always there for the family who is stable reliable who has the authority who takes the responsibility who is stable reliable center who governs that's what father is he takes care of the family so naturally leadership is also signified by planet sun i had to say planet sun but it is far more than that i'm sorry these are the keywords associated with sun so what is the secret message he has to give you so what is the secret message he has to give you wherever sun, wherever sun is placed you will you will shine there you will be confident you will be creative you will be confident about that the house signification of it what do i mean by that if you have sun in 10th house so you will shine in career the power authority wherever you have sun you will shine in that area of your life so these are the symbolism sun is holding and setting into your horoscope somewhere so these are the areas wherein he is going to take all these significations positive or negative depending upon the condition of sun altered debilitated where is the leo sign where it is placed the yuti shadbala lajjata diavastha all these things and then when you come to a conclusion whether it's powerful or not these are the significations which he will take to that house and will give you the result this was the sun which i could grab and grasp and could deliver and share with you guys so this was this was sun for you if you are new to my channel please consider subscribing and if you don't know where your sun is placed please go to my website get your free vedic horoscope i feel that is the best way to start your vedic journey and if you like this video hit that like button 
Otherwise, we will see you in the next video. Keep watching Pramanic Astrology channel. Love and peace.